I wanted to share with you. Um, like even cooler than playing the cello. <laughs> uh, but it's about how to play the cello standing. So um, I kind of came up with it, um, well, obviously not by myself because there's other people who know how to do it, who've done it, and there's um, a, something called, I think it's called the cello strap even, but there's a guy who um, devised this strap um, that you can play standing and also walking, you can walk with it, so with your cello. But I think it's like $150 or, I mean, it's a little bit, it's expensive, but it's worth it, I'm sure. But anyways, I only want to spend about $10. So I did spend about $10. I can't walk with my cello, but I can play it standing. Um, what's the difference between just playing it standing without using something? It's a little bit hard to get um, bow contact and for your bow to stay into the string. Um, you can do it, but it's just, it's a little bit, um, it's not very stable. So it's better to have something. So anyway, so I just bought a um, guitar strap. That's all this is. And you see it's got the holes on either side. Can you see it's got the holes on this side? So you hook it onto a guitar, right? But um, <laughs> um, just because now uh, we moved and so I'm constantly measuring like rugs or room spaces so I can buy rugs and stuff like that. Anyway, so um, <laughs> let's see how long this one is. I have it set out to 50 inches, so just over four feet. And I need, I need all of that um, length. So that's how long this one is. This brand is a um, Protec. But then what I got is a little hook because you need some, a way to attach them together. So it's just like a little S hook kind of thing like that. Um, it's similar to what Ikea sells for when you hook your um, pots and pans onto the little rack thing. So I'm going to just put it through the hole. Oh, yeah, I have to get my cello. Then so my cello, I take my end pin out almost all the way. I'll leave about like an inch. I'll leave about an inch in because otherwise it's a little wobbly. So I have my cello up ready standing. And it's harder to play. I mean, it, you can play, like I said, standing up, but it's really not that easy. Oopsie, <laughs> I'm already slipping. It's very hard. So it's not so, yeah, I'm, I'm slipping a little bit here. And, and what I what I have is I have my foot, my knee like back behind the instrument, so it's kind of keeping the instrument balance. But you can't really see, but like I'm on my toe, I'm like that. So it's not very easy to play. It's very unstable, and I don't like the it. Strap right, and then I'll just put it around the body of the instrument. Okay. And then I hook it up in the and behind me. So, um, yeah, it takes just a second to find the hole. Or you can like do it on the side or whatever. But um, yeah, so then now all of a sudden the, the cello is really pushed in towards my body. So now you probably, you can't really see, but my, my legs, my feet, I can stand with my feet flat on the floor. And that makes a huge difference. So then here the strap goes around the corners of the, the instrument or on the ribs and so it keeps it um, pretty tight but I can still move a little bit and that's great and so now to play like I can move a little bit before it, I kind of, I'm struggling to hold it and so anyway so the, the purpose of standing to play for me anyway is um, I sing jazz and and play cello um, and then I'm co-writing some tunes where I play cello and sing and such so it's good for that and like I've gigged with my cello standing and it's great but also 
like if you are, uh, I've done some quartet gigs for weddings where the violins and viola, they were standing and I was sitting and so it looks kind of funny. So like for weddings and wedding gigs, if you do those or like any kind of quartet gigs or you know, whatever, if you're playing at a gig, you can stand with the other, uh, with the other, with your group members and um yeah i think it i mean it just looks better it looks great it has you know it, you have to change a little bit of how you play but not really much um so i definitely recommend it it's just a guitar strap it's like i think i said it was like 10 bucks you can just order it online and it'll come to your door it's super duper easy and um yeah that's it thanks for watching i'm lisa berry bye